Hi, my name is Seven, the author, or Seven, um, and welcome to my YouTube channel, Seven uh, CPS Certified Hair Specialist. Many of you uh, probably are familiar with my channel, uh, well, my subs, <laughs> um, and so, um, I have like 65 subs, haven't had many over the course of five years. And if you have, uh, or a sub of mine, you know that, uh, I, uh, have been vibing, uh, the, uh, Black Awakening, um, the awakening of the coming of, um, the Lord, coming of the Most High, uh, and what many aboriginals call simply regeneration of the earth, the heavenlies, and um, uh, the most high realm. So, however, um, we have moved along in time. Um, and so we are now at a place where the call is out, um, the trumpet are blowing from everywhere and now those of us who have had our hands on the plow for the past seven years we know it is now time to feed the chicks it is time to focus on our well-being from the highest celestial or spiritual to psychological to physical this is where we at um, and so here family I am taking the approach um, that I am so familiar with throughout my life, and that is, uh, um, I guess you can say I'm that friend that listens. I have an adaptation to counsel and just assuring people and making people feel well about themselves. <clears throat> it's a part of my personality. Um, you know, over the years, we adapt our personality and mine has always been, been to um, make people feel good. And of course, it has a lot to do with me, how I was raised. And of course, we'll get, get into that. However, the purpose of this part of my journey is to share my story Um Share what I have been in. And the Most High tells me this is the best way to do it because when um, you're all sounding the alarms, you know, we, we, we all have our different gifts, our, our skills that we've learned throughout the years. And so you come to that place in the journey, which we're on, where it's like, what can I give specifically? That is my perspective, my unique place in all of this called life. And what did I learn? And what's so beautiful about me, fam, is that I am at that peak point in my life where I'm um, retired, I'm educated, degree, um, and have had a full life. Um, uh, not only on the skill aspect, but adventure. And so with this phase, this new platform, um, Certified Peer Specialist, I have taken the time um, to learn how to help others who is experiencing the same things that I'm experiencing. And what we're talking on my channel is mental health and recovery. And some physical health as well because they're all connected. And so um, this is the video where I'm going to introduce to you. Um, I, I guess kind of, I, I can't get it all right now, but what is Certified Peer Specialist? what we do, and for me specifically, uh, you will learn that uh, uh, Certified Peer Specialist was created, um, you know, I don't know who came up with, oh, SAMHSA, SAMHSA, 
and I'll get into that. I'll explain that later. Those are acronyms for a government agency, health agency, who came up with the standards in the background. But here, fam, I am specifically focusing on Aboriginal African Americans who are descendant of slaves at us. And so even though with, say, uh, certified peer support, peer, certified peer specialists, the focus is on recovery, substance, um, addictions, all the various ones, you know, however, that you, you, whatever your story is, that is who you relate to. For this video, for, for my platform, however, in, in where I want to contribute, I can contribute to ADOS. I can contribute to our struggle to move on as a people. Here is where I can use the certified peer specialist, not in the capacity, maybe as SAMHSA would say, okay, you know, we got just this particular guideline or whatever for adults. However, in peer specialist training, I did learn that um, there are specific criteria for cultural competence. What does that mean? That means specific for your particular ethnicity, your particular nationality. And so when uh, a certified peer specialist is um, within an organization, uh, an institution, a medical uh, organization or, or what have you, when they share their story, that is taken in, into consideration. So say you walk into an organization, say private or um, public, and you are a, uh, 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 just say a person from somewhere in Central America. And so, you know, you speak English, but, you know, and so you want to talk to someone who um has an understanding of your culture and may speak some Spanish. And so within this uh, certified peer specialist, that can be done for you. That peer support specialist can, um, can be found. So what I'm doing for um, my YouTube channel, for the platform, and my part in the struggle of uh, ADOS equality even at this juncture, the year 2021, I'm not going to go through the history, y'all know. I'm going strictly uh, approaching it from seeking mental health. And so where am I coming from? Um, I'm going to get into my disclaimer on my channel. I'm going to get into how I am not a clinician. My job here, what my mission is to direct you to an organization, to where you may be going at a health facility, you may be already using uh, your your um, insurance, health insurance, um, in an organization, they may have a peer support there. So what I'm doing here, fam, ADOS, is that I'm going to tell you my story on the next video. Uh, uh, that will give you an idea of the, um, spaces where I can share, where I've experienced and where I'm coming from. And you're going to get it in a few minutes. And then, so we can address it from there. And so what I'll be doing, I won't be per se, um, because with, I have to put this here. And I hope you're keeping up with me. I have a tendency to jump around. <laughs> um, but here in this platform, we cannot say specifically work didactic. In other words, with this, the, the certified peer specialist and the client, the peer, there is trust there. There is the confidentiality uh, perspective aspect of our job. So we won't be able to do this here. You won't be able to say, oh, yeah, let me, oh, yeah, yeah, what seven just covered there. Oh, I experienced that. Girl, let me tell you about this. No, we don't want you to do that, okay? 
Uh, what you can do, you can listen, you can say, wow, I relate to that. You may ask some general questions about things. You know, some people say a friend of mine. <laughs> we really don't want to put your pertinent information in the, in, in the comment section, but kind of just like, yeah, yeah. So what I'm doing here is, number one, let's recognize that we have some mental stuck points, some mental challenges, ADOS. It's not new for the brain to need help, for the brain to need a practitioner. So that's one thing. I want to help us get over that. So let me go ahead and read uh, the introduction here, which is basically like, yeah, this is what's coming. This is what I'm doing on the channel. I want you to sub, you know, thumbs up all that. We'll go over that. I had to write it down. So uh, I'm seven CPS uh, certified pre specialist. And this is the new platform for my YouTube channel. Come back here. All right. The objective is to present peer support services to the Aboriginal and African American descendants of slaves, ADOS, Black community, addressing mental health and substance abuse in our homes uh, by sharing my personal recovery story. We must ring the bell, ADOS, in our communities, our homes, about mental health. Yet, due to our cultural mistrust of a national medical system historically known to abuse, neglect, and experiment on Black bodies, what we collectively, our communities, experience symptomatic triggers against professional psychiatric counseling. So in other words, what? It's like a trigger. And we know something about that, those who've been in recovery. You get triggers, and then you think about picking up, you know, the smoke or whatever, the coffee or whatever, the, 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 that other piece of chocolate. So we, we want to ring the bell that as a community, we have symptomatic triggers against uh, medical care, medical institutions, period, especially psychiatric counseling. In our community, it's like you're weak. We can, and so we know how all, all of that came about. So many of you cover that so well, but here we want to come and we want to have a space where, you know what, I may not want to go to counseling. I may not want to give in that, to that because I'm not getting over the triggers. And then what's happening? We're having these old um, uh, demons of our our nation's history coming back. So that, that makes you even more apprehensive. So I'm excited about this. Um, and I just got the motivation to say, well, I need to do it. Seven do it. So we're going to go by seven. Um, and so that's what we're going to do. Uh, this is the video basically where I'm just coming out and saying, Hey, you all, I haven't forgotten. Um, you know, I'm, I'm did my part <laughs> of announcing, uh, our regenerating earth. And so welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, I'm Anita seven author, veteran, and certified uh, peer specialist, um, and I'm sharing my story so that you can survive yours. You will survive, I promise you. So please make sure to subscribe, like, hit the notification bell. That sounds so funny. <laughs> Coming out of my mouth. <laughs> I got it down when you are my favorite uh, um, uh, YouTubers do it, uh, to alert you of my uploads. And I'll see you on the next video with my personal recovery story. Wow. So, yeah. All right. That's it. I'm looking forward to seeing you guys on the next video. ADOS, I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. So, Mm-hmm. <laughs>